housing construction is down to its lowest level this year. The Commerce Department says home building fell 10% last month, a sharper decline than analysts had expected. Economist Hugh Johnson with Johnson Hillington Advisors says there are no longer any federal tax credits for home buyers to bolster home construction. With the expiration of those uh, tax credits, we're seeing some weakness in housing in just about every number that you look at. Separate report this morning, the Labor Department says wholesale prices declined three-tenths of a percent last month thanks to a drop in energy costs. On Wall Street, the Dow is down 39 points. This is NPR News from Washington. And this is WSIU Radio, your NPR station. It's 80 degrees in Carbondale, 77 in Mount Vernon, and 77 in Albany at 904. Good morning, I'm Jennifer Fuller. Plus sunshine today will see a high around 88 degrees and a northwest wind around 5 miles an hour. In the news this morning, prosecutors at former Governor Rob Blavich's corruption trial are slated to resume questioning a former associate of convicted fixer Tony Rezco today. Joseph Aramanda spent several hours on the stand yesterday telling a complex tale of how money travels between a Springfield lobbyist 